that have hearing impairments and 65 million that have speech disorders throughout the world. We are here with our product, Dwani, the voice of the PWDs. So we are a smart band that offers three key functionalities. Our device is a smart band that is worn around the wrist just like a smartwatch. But the only difference is that it performs some life-saving functions and help the PWDs become self-dependent. For the customer insights, we have visited 10 plus schools and have interacted six, with 600 plus students to make them aware. And from those, we got a feedback that they need a device for pothole tracking and animal tracking. functionality is object detection. So for object detection, we are using two sensors. The first is the camera module, as you can see, and the second is ultrasonic sensors. So currently on the screen, you can see the input that we are getting through the camera module. It is being uh, utilizing our algorithm and we are identifying objects. This will further calculate the distance of these objects from the person who is wearing our band and will help the blind person to understand what is the position of an obstacle. The second is the ultrasonic sensor, which assists the people to not only find obstacles in their linear path, but also help them identify the elevation. So if a person with visual impairment is walking, uh, like climbing up the stairs or descending the stairs or a step, they will easily come to know through our device that there is a depression or an elevation. In this feature, it is meant for the people, normal people to communicate with the deaf people and uh, through our algorithm, transcription algorithm, people can speak and the text audio signals will be converted to text and that is displayed on this screen. Currently that has been displayed here and through this, the deaf people can hear us, uh, can read whatever we are saying, which will help to carry the conversation in a very smooth way. Our algorithm has very less latency and high accuracy even in noisy environments. As I can demonstrate, this is the demonstration part of our speech to text functionality. In this functionality, we are able to converse with deaf people without even knowing the sign language. And once the whole thing is shifted to our microcontroller and with integrated with a battery pack, we will not be needing an active internet connection to run this particular algorithm and this will help to harness the barrier between deaf people and other people who are not aware of sign language. Our third functionality is gesture recognition. This functionality is for people with speech impairments. We identify the gesture by taking the cam input from the camera and then our algorithm identifies what particular gesture the person is performing. So as a person with speech disorder wants to communicate with the other people who do not know sign language, they will perform the gesture right in front of the camera, which will convert the gesture and uh, identify a text. The text will then be converted into an audio output, which the other people can hear. Eantra taught us that engineering is not restricted to a particular discipline and uh, through this uh, I myself being a mechanical engineer did the work of an IT engineer, uh, EC engineer and even uh, we have even done the work of an uh, MBA graduate to do the market research. So it took us from one restricted domain to a domain of rainbows like we are doing everything that has been taken to run a startup to innovate. Not a single microcontroller is sufficient to do all the single use cases. And the biggest problem which we faced is this only, to decide which microcontroller we have to use. You have to analyze a lot and lot on, you know, manuals of electronic engineering and you have to study microcontrollers and you have to study the use cases. market research in a particular way, the, how the question should be framed, what all parameters should we keep in mind, which actually were very effective. Otherwise, we would not be able to think about them properly. Doing market research is the most important thing because we cannot look at a product from just our perspective. The people who are going to use it, the product that we are developing for, they need to you know, come and give the inputs. gave me the vision to not just let it be an idea. It told me how I should make it into a market-ready product and I worked towards it. The sessions, 
all the sprints the competition details every single thing led me to you know churn my head and make this into a product as an individual i can feel that now i can make uh, a living even if i don't have a job or i don't go for an internship or a higher studies yantra made me a valuable asset from a student i can now feel i am a valuable asset i can remember the session from desh pande sir he said that how even a single color in your logo can completely change the vision of your brand in front of people we were engineers we are not business people we don't know how to make a business out of anything that person told us that how the business model works how b2b b2c b2b2c all these models work where should we place our product what should be the market price how user perceive it these mooks told us to be in constraints but they didn't put any kind of limitations to us that was the best uh, thing about these mooks in our camera module first you know breathe its initial pixels I literally jumped out of my chair and that was something which gave me so much joy that even graduation will not give me that joy. For me Eentra is not a competition the whole 6 month span was like living a different life. Like uh, when we participated I didn't go to college to study I go to college to meet with my team and to discuss them from hours and hours of you know like brainstorming session. Like uh, we through this competition came to know about the resources which we never ever you know know at our disposal that you know teachers are supportive we can get help from here it is a marathon like a marathon which shapes you as an individual just like in our old movies there was a transition that a boy was running in childhood and then he you know completely convert into adult being same happens in eentra you starts with baby steps about not even knowing how to frame a proposal and you ended up giving a detailed 15 pages of a ppt about your customer review and about your business models please participate and don't let uh, your stream to make a hindrance for you don't think that you are from electronics you can't even touch a single program from it or you can't do 3d modeling every single student out there should participate in eentra because it's not just a competition it's something that shapes you it's something that not a school not your parents not your friends would like directly teach you it's something that you learn on your own but eentra provides you that environment and you get that experience we do project just to win that competition and being a finalist of eentra i win i don't win and like i'm completely above it all because i know i have a startup ready with me or i can do with the idea so if you want yourself to become an asset if you want yourself to do things to solve real world problem not projects you should definitely part in eyic